I'm Alexi Panos and today Operation Build is celebrating Earth Day. I'm traveling all over the U.S. to connect with eco-minded companies and learn more about what they do. April 22, 1970 was the first Earth Day celebration. On that day, 20 million people gathered on the streets of America to protest the Industrial Revolution. An environmental change was born. Gaylord Nelson founded Earth Day while he was working as a senator. 45 years later, Earth Day is celebrated globally. In 2012, more than 100,000 people rode bikes in China to reduce CO2 emissions and save fuel. In Panama, a hundred endangered species of orchids were planted and maintained to prevent their extinction in honor of Earth Day. You will not believe where I'm standing. Check this out. This is a living building and it's truly amazing. So what exactly is a living building? Well, it incorporates natural living systems with the latest green technology. It's designed to save energy, reduce carbon emissions and water consumption, and create an overall healthier living environment. This kind of sustainable environment for offices and homes is in the future. It's real and it's now. This huge atrium and the vegetation throughout the building provides enriched oxygen which creates an amazing indoor air quality and an actual connection to nature. This is only a fraction of how this living building functions with the environment in the most green way possible. And what better location to launch our Earth Day special? So let's see how green America really is on this 45th anniversary of Earth Day. So many companies across the U.S. and worldwide are committed to a manufacturing process that's both eco-friendly and 100% green. Ox Industries is at the top of that list as a company that's been committed from the beginning to environmental responsibility and manufacturing products that are 100% green and eco-friendly. From the beginning, Ox Industries' philosophy has been to manufacture total eco-friendly products, paper, and building products. I'm here with Kevin Hayward, owner of Ox Industries. Kevin, thanks so much for being a part of our Earth Day special. Tell me more about the Ox Industries' philosophy. Well, Lexi, our uh, company was founded on manufacturing green products. Uh, we operate our uh, company manufacturing three different product categories paper tubes and cores and protective packaging, 100% recycled paperboard, and uh, as you see here, engineered building products. It's so cool, and um, obviously an earth-friendly company like yourself must do something special on Earth Day. How do you guys celebrate? Well, Earth Day is special for us. Um, we do it by celebrating uh, Earth Day and educating the youth and the communities that we serve. We do it with a uh, paper drive, which allows us the opportunity to teach kids about recycling, teach them about energy efficiency, and how green building uh, can actually help save the environment and potentially using the products that we manufacture to do that. That's incredible. Now, obviously being Operation Build, I want to know more about these green building products. So we manufacture three products, uh, thermal ply, structural sheathing, ISO red, continuous insulation, and a combination of those two, which is styrofoam cis, which is a structural insulated sheet. Wow, so what's the difference between that and everything else that's out there? The products that we manufacture are green alternatives to traditional building products. Our structural thermoply is a stable priced alternative to a traditional wood panel which is typically like an oriented strand board or a plywood board for the exterior of the home. Our polyiso insulation adds our value uh, to the exterior of the house and complies with all 2012 energy code standards. I know a lot of people, when they're looking for this uh, eco-friendly thing, they're also looking for an economic benefit as well. Is there that that's involved? Well, our thermoply is a stable priced alternative to those products, those traditional uh, products. And not only is it stable, stable priced from a price point, but it's also uh, easier and lower cost to use in the field. 
Is there savings over the long term? For our structural insulated sheathing, uh, there's savings over the long term uh, in energy efficiency. Uh, as you may or may not know, there's 41% of all U.S. energy consumed in the United States is, is through the operation of our buildings wow. in the United States. Wow. And 73% of that is electricity. So having a more energy efficient home is uh, all part of uh, energy savings of the operation of the house, maintaining the um, value, long-term value of the home because of its low operation costs. And do you guys do work with green builders? We do. Uh, we uh, were fortunate enough to be part of a multifamily uh, low-income housing home in uh, Richmond, Virginia. It was the first net near zero project in the area at the time. Um, also, we're part of a Leeds Silver housing development and right in Dallas, uh, which is also the location of the largest Earth Day celebration in the United States this year. Wow. Part of that education with our youth it allows them to understand the economic side of uh, recycling and energy efficiency. It also allows them to raise money by collecting uh, recyclables that are going to eventually be in those products and raise money for the, the causes that they have or the programs that they have in their schools. Currently, Ox Paperboard recycles 105,000 tons of paper each year. That's equal to 367,000 cubic yards saved from landfills annually and 17 trees per ton, which basically means that 1.7 million trees are saved each year by using these products. So from a consumer standpoint, why is it important that we look for products that are green and eco-friendly? Uh, because it's sustainable. It's something that we must do to continue to move forward going ahead. You know, part of the 2012 Energy Code standards are because of the added increased efficiencies of our buildings reduces our need to build more power plants, coal-fired power plants, nuclear power plants. Uh, you know, if we waste less energy um, by insulating or making our homes more energy efficient, we improve the environment and the communities that we're living in. Well, Kevin, thank you so much for inviting me in and showing me how this works. It's so cool to learn all this stuff. And for those of you out there, don't go anywhere because we have more coming up on this special edition of Operation Build. We get to meet a family, hear their amazing story, and get to address a long-awaited eco need. Stay tuned. Earth Day originated in the U.S., but became recognized worldwide by 1990. Thanks for watching this special Earth Day edition of Operation Build. As always, if you know of someone in need or suffering a negative life circumstance, we hope you'll email us. And don't forget to like us on Facebook and follow us on Twitter. Until next time, I'm Alexi Panos.